this is um, this is a character uh, on a wanted poster. Uh, he actually it doesn't really appear much in the film, mostly just a wanted poster. And um, so I sketched it out. You can see he sketched it out. This is wanted. And then I'm going to put a sign here that says caught because uh, Rod Rossi, the uh, one man posse, uh, this is one of the characters that he caught. He's famous for catching fugitives. Okay, you can see I recycled my drawings. This is a, a bad drawing I did earlier. I don't like to waste paper. I got that from being a kid when I never had enough drawing paper. But I will uh, do the wanted poster first. Uh, this is a regular Sharpie I'm using. This film is done with a Sharpie. We'll get so that. here's the guy. He's kind of a uh, bookworm guy, kind of an intellectual, but yet he's a crook. And that's why I think makes him interesting. Um, you can see I'm really pretty sloppy with this line. And I like to make it a little off balance. Uh, I don't want to make everything perfect. And that's... Uh, that gives it a character, that gives the film a lot of character, that it's, it's not a perfect perfect drawing. It's kind of like the Anthony Perkins in um, Psycho. He's got a lot of uh, craziness underneath his uh, calm exterior. So now I can turn the light off, because I don't need the, I don't need the light anymore, and I'll fill in the rest of the, uh, the poster. See there, I made a mistake there, but that's okay. That's part of this um, of this film. And then I'll go and add a little uh, texture and a little shadow here and there. Now there's something really cool about working with Jim. He's uh, he's got a, a very interesting. Um, uh, cast of characters. It's kind of like Damon Runyon. If you know who Damon Runyon is, he was a big uh, writer of um, from New York or Chicago actually, uh, back in the 30s and 40s, and he did all the um, all the gangsters. He was the guy who did Guys and Dolls and and um, some other great films. And so this is that character. All these people who are the un. un underground of, of New York City of culture and actually not New York City Los Angeles and I love uh, LA and that's why I like uh, like this because it really shows I'll put some hair up here again it's kind of yeah it really looks seedy <laughs>